Suppose we have a cupboard full of sports equipment. We want to find out, besides equipment for cricket, what other equipment there is. To do this, we remove all the cricket equipment, leaving behind a basketball, a football, and a racket. We say that we have subtracted the set of cricket equipment from the set of sports equipment in the cupboard. The subtraction operation is called difference. To subtract set B from set A, we write A difference B. Because this is the minus symbol, we can also read this expression as A minus B. It can also be written as A backslash B. Be careful. Do not confuse this with the forward slash. A difference B is the set that includes elements which are contained in set A but not in set B. In the set builder notation, it can therefore be written as X such that X belongs to set A and X does not belong to set B. Conversely, to subtract set A from set B, we write B difference A or B backslash A. This is a set of all the elements of the set B that are not in set A. In the set builder notation, this equals X such that X belongs to set B and X does not belong to set A. Let's see what this means with a simple example. Let's set A contain the elements 3, 4, and 5. And set B contain the elements 0, 1, 2, and 3. A difference B will include elements which are contained in set A, but not in set B. Of the elements in set A, 3 is also in set B, while 4 and 5 are not. Therefore, a difference B will give a set containing 4 and 5. How about B difference A? This will include elements which are contained in set B but not in set A. Of the elements in set B, 3 is also in set A, while 0, 1 and 2 are not. Therefore, B difference A will contain 0, 1 and 2. Notice that A difference B is not equal to B difference A. In general, this is true for any two sets. Now try to solve this problem. Let's solve it. Set A contains natural numbers that are less than or equal to 5. So its elements are 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Set B contains prime numbers that are between 2 and 7, both inclusive. So its elements are 2, 3, 5, and 7. A difference B will include elements which are contained in set A, but not in set B. Of the elements in set A, 2, 3, and 5 are also in set B, while 1 and 4 are not. Hence, this set contains the elements 1 and 4. B difference A includes elements which are contained in set B, but not in set A. It will contain a single element, which is 7. Recall that this is called a singleton set. A difference A includes elements that are contained in set A, but not in set A. Since there is no such element, this is an empty set. Similarly, B difference B is also an empty set. When we take the difference of a set with itself, the result will always be an empty set. To summarize, for the two sets A and B, A difference B is a set of all elements of the set A that are not in set B. B difference A is a set of all elements of the set B that are not in set A. Generally, A difference B is not equal to B difference A. Now, are you ready for a challenge? When does A difference B 
equal b difference a, 